All right, today we're checking out John Fogarty. We listened to the song Centerfield. Let's get into it. You know what this reminds me of? What? So this is like how, as a kid, I used to think they used to sing in the kitchen at Waffle House. What? You know what I mean? Like when they're cooking them hash browns, you know what I'm saying? You know those Waffle House hash browns when they're like all golden and crispy on the okay. outside? You know what I mean? Kind of mushy <laughs> on the inside. I used to feel, like the way his voice sounds reminds me of how I used to feel about the cooks at Waffle House when I was a kid, you know? Okay, this is complex. But you didn't really think they sang as well, they were no, cooking I figured they could right? be like frying up some stuff like Santa Fe. Like they would, you know what I mean? Like that texture is just so Waffle House to me. Okay, so this song gives you the feeling of eating at Waffle House, yes. basically. Okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. It's like a little down home, you know what I mean? It's just different, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like there's, it's just a different like day. Is this like your relative's kitchen? But it's not, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I figure you want to relate to this in a literal way because it's about sports. Yeah. If you play sports, you can relate this in a, in a literal way. A literal way. Yeah. Okay. Like put me in coach literally. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. No. But I don't know all this baseball history, all these people they're naming. I don't, I don't know. Me.
okay, so it's like strange to me because like I totally can't relate to the athletic side of it, but the sound and the feeling I can totally relate to, but it takes me like Waffle House. Yeah, I was trying to think of an analogy for you to relate to, but I can't. Uh, I can't think of anything else than like wanting your coach to put you in the game. Like. Because like, you uh, did dance team, but yeah. I mean, in dance I team, you're, you're always in the game in dance team. Not necessarily. I mean, sometimes you're like in the back. Yeah, but you're still in. True. But I guess it's like, give me a solo. Oh, like in, if you played in a band? No, no, like the dance solo. Like a solo, oh. like, you know, a solo part. Uh, sure. I don't <laughs> no, know. I can't think of anything like Something it. Something like that. I don't know. It's Maybe uh, if like I'm in the kitchen cooking and you see I'm not doing that well and you just want to take over. Never happens. It'd be like, tap me in, tap me in, Brett. Let me take over. I could do it better. Maybe like it that. never happens. <laughs> I'd be like, please burn it, destroy it. <laughs> I love it when you cook, so. Because it doesn't really happen that often. Yeah, there's, I can't think of a good analogy. Yeah, to me, I was just getting hash browns at Waffle House. You know those crispy on the outside, but warm and squishy? What about like a road trip when the driver's not doing that well? You're like, I want to drive. Okay. Tap me in. Okay. Yeah, right. You need to stop. With Couch Mama, I can completely relate. <laughs> yeah, what about like, maybe okay. like that. Okay. But then it's like you reluctantly, it's like, I'll take over because I feel like my life is in danger. It's not no, like it's not reluctant for me. Like, give me the steering wheel. Okay. I don't know. Tell me, man, what do you know? What do you know? Me and my boys on the road. Who to go? She told me, boy, you to go. Like I don't know. 